Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Um, it's gonna be a little bit of an, a little bit. It's gonna be an unboxing. We have Mac joining us today because he has to be monitored. He had his surgery Monday, today's Wednesday. So we're going on day like two and a half of his recovery. And it's, it's been a moment. Um, so that is why I look the way I look. Uh, I don't have makeup on. I haven't had makeup on in three days. Um, I've been very worried about this little guy right here. Say hi. Um, so we've just been focused on healing him and getting him back to normal. Today he is up, he is about, he actually has not had any pain medication yet, so we have that going for us. And I'm very, very happy and I'm very blessed that everything went well. But Mac, who is smack dab in the middle of the camera right now, is not the reason we're here today guys ipsy finally came ipsy plus came um birch box came plus i got a few little goodies that i wasn't expecting in the mail so we are gonna go ahead and do an unboxing um i will warn you i have pre-opened some of it because again i'm I'm focused on watching him and making sure he's okay. So let me put him on the little bed next to me so he can take a nap while we film and we'll get started. Okay. Uh, if you didn't know, I do wear glasses and contacts. Usually I have contacts on, but um, yeah, y'all, it's, it's been a stressful few days. Um, the day he had his surgery, I was, I was an, an, an emotional wreck. So let's go ahead and just start with the few things that came in the mail last night that I wasn't expecting. Um, first up, I got something from Condé Nast that says time to try it we think you'll love the product as much as the discovery and if you equally if you have equally obsessed beauty obsessed friends invite them to join the try it experience um the package just says pat mcgrath mcgrath oh my gosh so i don't know what it is we are gonna go ahead and just open it real quick i think it's her new mascara I saw it on Tati's channel. Oh, huh. Wow. Learn to read, Blake. It is the new mascara. I'm excited. I've never tried anything by Pat McGrath. My mom swears by one of her lipsticks. So this is what it looks like. Just a little black tube. Ooh. Okay, well, we will, I will give that a try. I go back to work tomorrow, so I'll probably try it tomorrow. It reminds me a lot of the Better Than Sex wand. Okay, next up, I got this from Laneige. Um, I have two samples of the Waterbank Moisture Cream, which I'm actually wearing right now. Um, I did previously receive, like, seven of these little duos. I love it. It's great. Um... I have no complaints. I think they're the same thing. Let me just double check. Yes, water. they're both with the Water Bank Moisture Cream. Um, I just used the last one today. I use them on days when I need some super hydration. And then I also have a sample of the Water Sleeping Mask, which I will use tonight because I go back to work tomorrow and I need all the help I can get. If I'm going to be honest, I need all the help I can get. Okay, so we have Ipsy and Birchbox. Um, I'm going to go with Birchbox because it's the bulkier one. 
and I'm, this video is not going to be a try on. Um, this is literally just the unboxing. So invent the reality you want to live. The future starts now. Okay, so first up we have the N4 High Performance Prep and Protect Hair Care. I've tried something by them before. It wasn't something that I'm like, oh my gosh. Okay, next we have the IPKN Moist and Firm BB in the shade Light Medium. Please, it's sealed. Okay. All right, so that actually looks like it will match. I will do a try on. Actually, it does appear to have some pretty decent coverage to it. Okay. Next, we have the Kills, 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 Kills. Oh my goodness. Midnight Recovery Eye. And I have not tried this before, so I am excited to try this. Mm, smells nice, actually. Okay. Oh my goodness, that lid does not want to go back on. Next, we have the Lightning Crew. Lightning Crew. This is a highlighter, a liquid highlighter. Um. So I. Th I think you can kind of use this as a primer as well, but I don't know. All right, last we have the Aero Boost Color Enhancing Lip Balm. I'm going to use this now because my lips are feeling really dry. Did it do anything? I don't think it did anything. All right, well, that was... Uh, birch box. So the full size of the number four is $32. It's a leave in conditioning mist um, that protects your hair from heat damage and UV rays. The full size of the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Eye is $37. It minimizes dark lines and dark, I mean, minimizes lines and dark circles. Reduce puffiness, hydrate before bed, pat two drops under eye. So two drops, that should last me like at least a week. The full size of the IPKN Moist and Firm Beauty Balm with SPF 45 is $29. Has vitamin E and collagen. The Beauty Crop Lightning Crew Highlighting Cream. Uh... All over luminous look if you mix in with your foundation or cream and you can use it as a regular highlighter and then the exclusive Aero boost color enhancing lip balm I feel like most lips still look the same magically adjust your lips pH to create a flattering rosy pink hue that's unique to you did it change? I don't feel like it changed, but this is $15. Okay. There we go. There we have it. That's Birchbox. Um, the only thing in there that I can really see myself going, yes, I need it, I want it, is the lip balm. All right. Next we have Ipsy. Um, I don't know where I put it, but... Oh, there it is. Okay, so spoiler alert. I already know one thing that's in. It's the Hava face mask because I knew I was getting a face mask. I get one every single week from, or month from Ipsy. So I went ahead and I dug through here. But it's the only thing that I've opened and actually looked at. I just knew I was getting something skincare related and I needed something skincare related today. This is the Lottie London Shimmer Squad highlighter and I assume the shade is called the good girl that almost looks too dark for me hold on uh, yeah let's see oh well, maybe not all right so that does appear to be a pretty color uh it 
I'm going to go ahead and assume it's very buildable. If not, it'll be, that would actually probably look really pretty over that BB cream that we got in Birchbox. By the way, Lottie London is cruelty free. In the event, no one knew. All right, next we have the Seat London Lip Luster in the shade Wildfire. Am I the only one? It smells fruity. Am I the only one that like feels like Ipsy just does not follow your profile? That is really sheer. It's actually kind of pretty. Okay, that is actually very pretty. Let's put it on top of our lip balm. Oh, it doesn't have that gross stickiness that most. Like shimmery. Okay, so heads up, you can feel the glitter. It's like a light exfoliant for your face. Moving on. All right, next we have Space Case. Goody. Um, Space Case is vegan and cruelty free. I know Seattle London is cruelty free. Why is this package so impossible to open? Um, this says nothing. Oh, it's an eyeshadow. I was like, it says nothing. It's an eyeshadow I'm probably never going to use. Am I the only one that feels like that's not very springy? Okay, well, it feels really smooth. It is a pretty green. It's just, I feel like it's a, I don't wear a lot of green. That's pretty though. Okay, well that is very pretty. While I probably won't wear it. Okay, and last but not least, we have a Morphe bronzer. Oh goody. I got an entire Morphe eyeshadow palette for Boxy Lux this month. So why don't we just go with some Morphe bronzer? Okay, this is the shade. It's the shade Debutante. Ooh, that is creamy though. I just, I feel like this might actually be too orange for me. I'll try it. That does blend really nicely though. Next we have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. Ipsy got here yesterday. The Glam Bag Plus I got here today. It actually was not supposed to be here until Friday. So I am pleasantly surprised. Let's open it real quick. Mac, you okay? Okay. Sorry if I seem distracted, guys. I just really want to make sure he is okay. Okay, your March Glam Bag Plus is here to help you put your best face forward. Okay, first things first, we have, oh, and it's open. That's fun. We have Real Her I Am Adaptable Matte Liquid. Wow, that is red. Okay. I do like the handle though. It's really, or the lid. It's really shimmery. That is very red. Wow. Okay. Okay. Well. That is very, very red. And it's actually bleeding. Okay. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of Real Her lipsticks. I like what they're doing. I like what they stand for. I'm just not the biggest fan of it. Oh, goody. The product I was least looking forward to for Ipsy. Um, this is Benefit Sunbeam Liquid Highlighter. Why I was sent Sunbeam, I will never know. Because... Yeah. That's just not going to look good on my skin. Oh. 
also it's just so subtle that it like literally disappears. So there is that. I will try it when I do my try on for the Ipsy Birchbox Plus. Next, we have a set of Farah eyeshadow brushes. This is B Beautiful B U Farah. Uh, it appears that there are five brushes in here. This actually feels pretty heavy. I'm not going to open them because I have so many eyeshadow brushes. I just, I don't want to open them. Ooh, okay. I was hoping I got this. All right, this is the Pure Elise. Oh my goodness. Blue Lotus Balancing Moisturizer. Hydration, fine line prevention, and it's perfect for day and night. Um, I was hoping to get this because I did see a spoiler for it. And my mom is currently in need of a good moisturizer. Ooh, that feels really good. It has like a jelly cream consistency. Like, it could be a gel. Oh, that is really good. Okay. So, it has antioxidants uh, with anti-inflammatory. Blue Lotus. Okay, I'm just going to read it. Blue Lotus is a powerful antioxidant known for its anti-inflammatory benefits. That's kind of why I want to give it to her. Um, her face gets irritated by some products very easily. White tea offers antibacterial with skin soothing abilities. Again, vitamin E prevents premature aging and improves skin texture. And French marine plants help retain moisture. Okay, so I'm going to give her this. I'm very excited about this. I'm so happy I got this. So freaking happy. Because I really was hoping I would get this so I can give it to her. All right. And last but not least, we have the Huda Beauty Smoky Obsessions Palette. It's the packaging. Cute packaging. I like how small it is. Dude, what the actual My eyeshadow arrives broken. Okay, so that is the unboxing. I'm going to email Ipsy about the Smoky Obsessions Palette that is presently all over my hands and all over my desk. But other than that, I wish I would have gotten, like, the coral one. But it is what it is. So, um, I'm very excited about the moisturizer. I'm going to give that to my mom. Everything else, I will be doing a try-on video. And breaking things in the process. So... All right, well, that is the unboxing for Ipsy, Ipsy Plus, and Birchbox. They all came within a few days of each other, so I'm very excited about that. Um, I actually really like this lip balm, and I like how glossy this gloss is. Anyway, well, I just smeared red lipstick in it, but yeah. I'm really excited to try these products for everyone that has sent MAC well wishes and healing vibes and positive vibes. I really appreciate you. Um, we are on our road to recovery. So I am going to go wash this off my hand and, oh, he's awake. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to go wash this off my hand. MAC honey. I'm going to go wash this off my hand, email Ipsy, and then go continue helping my baby recovery, go through his recovery. I know. Stop, baby. We will see you guys next video. Thank you for all your positive vibes, your healing vibes, and everything related to Mac. He is on the mend. Um, for anyone that's curious and doesn't already know he did have to have surgery because he had a hernia and i'm not going to show you his little wound 
because it's gross. But, well, some people will think it's gross. I don't think it's gross. He's my baby. So, I'm going to go feed him some dinner, give him his medication, and go lay down with him and keep him comfortable. So he does no jumping and all that fun stuff. We will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.